Hello my Taco Buddies, I'm Herman Frost and this is Taco Weekly and today I am here to review Yu-Gi-Oh! Art 5 Episode 64. It was a damn good episode, a damn good episode, but one thing I did not like relatively well was the fact that how they made yu Yu lose in this episode. Granted, I know that he has to lose sometimes in the series or he will get stale, boring, and the crowd will pretty much turn their back on him if he becomes this invincible god always fucking winning. So, they made yu Yu lose this episode. I didn't like how they made you lose this episode because all throughout this episode he's pretty much down in the dumps spilling sad the fact that his friends aren't there to support him yuzu's gone she don't know where the fuck he is and he has to worry about academia nonetheless and i'm just looking like poor fucking yuya and he went into the duel with the mindset of hey you know what fuck it i'm gonna lose i know i'm gonna lose so why even try that hard that's how they made him fucking appear to be in this episode also jack atlas man he's like the biggest dick in the synchro dimension right now he just pretty much comes on to the scene with his d wheel and he just goes i'm gonna beat him in three times and i'm just looking like god damn that's a fucking spit in the face three turns against yuya i was watching this episode and i'm just looking like <laughs> oh, oh okay three turns and i was looking like oh shit it just took three turns god damn but with that being said you guys let me read the synopsis for this episode <clears throat> The friendship cup finally starts with the duel between Jack Atlas and Yuya. Yugo and Yuzu come to watch the duel. Jack Atlas declares he will win in three turns. Jack summons a synchro monster, Wed Ryvern. Yuya then summons Ruin Eyes and Dark Rebellious. Jack then uses an action card to he uses an action card and his ace monster, uh, Red Demons Dragon Scarlet, to win the duel. I kind of stuttered there on the end. I hope you guys don't pretty much notice that. But with that being said, you guys. Wow, this fucking episode, man, it just, it just kind of took me by surprise. But with that being said, it also is revealed that Jack Atlas isn't even participating. He's the prize you get when you win the Friendship Cup. Even though Yuzu is there, Yuya had no one cheering for him. Jack was the crowd fucking favorite. I honestly expected that Yuzu was in the crowd, right? She was just sitting there just crying and shit, just looking at Yuzu. Uh, Yuzu was looking at uh, Yuya. I, I always get those two fucking names mixed up. She was looking at Yuya and she's looking like, he's here. He's finally here. And I'm just looking like, okay, okay. I know she's going to do it. What I was expecting her to do is see that uh, Yuya is dueling. I was expecting her to just scream out, Yuya, you can do it. And he gets the motivation that he needs, so he put up a better fight, but he still loses in the process. That's what I wanted to happen. That's what I wanted to see happen. The one time I wanted to see Yuzu fucking do something, she doesn't fucking do it. And I'm just looking like, holy fucking shit. Yuya, I feel fucking sorry for you. Even though Yuzu is there, she isn't fucking cheering for you. I'm just looking like, what the fuck? Also, Yugo in this episode, Yugo hands down, he was fucking hilarious because he just goes feel sorry for your friend man he's a fucking sacrifice for the king this is just a duel to make the king show off pretty much and he just goes after that like not even a minute later he just goes whoa jack atlas whoop his ass nigga he just pretty much is cheering on jack atlas non-stop man he just right by yuzu looking like she just looking like what the what the fuck we here for my friend he just goes jack yeah jack yeah jack that shit was hilarious. Hands down, that shit made my day in this episode. Also, um, the things I didn't like about this episode is them calling Yuya a sacrifice and Yuzu not cheering for him. Also, Yuya is pretty much saying the only guy going to take three turns. Not Yuya, it's Jack Atlas. He just says it's going to take three turns. That's the three main things I didn't like. Uh, them calling Yuya a sacrifice, Yuzu not cheering, and Jack Atlas over cocky ass attitude saying it's just going to take three turns even though it did take three turns and by the way <clears throat> yuya yuya he took a pretty fucking nasty fall off his uh um d wheel i'm just looking like god damn jack it's just a fucking children's card game and <laughs> I don't know why I, I'm just fucking sick in the head for, for uh, wanting this to happen. I wanted Yuya to do his little rainbow draw he always does. He just goes draw and just fall off his D wheel. I, I I just always want to see that shit like draw. 
and just fall off. That shit look like it will be fucking hilarious for anime. But with that being said, you guys, this episode goes off by Jack Atlas pretty much throwing salt on the wound, saying, this isn't your entertainment dueling. This is just pretty much self-pleasure um, or some shit he says like that. You're just pleasing yourself or some shit like that. But this episode goes off by Yuya falling off his D-wheel because he lost to Jack Atlas. I mean, he fell pretty goddamn hard. He just popped in the air. He just bounced in the air high as shit. And, wow, that duel, it was one-sided, you guys. But with that being said, let me go on to my predictions for next week's episode. <clears throat> so next week's episode is the Friendship Cup actually starts. And the first duel is going to be going to get Zaka and um, Crow. Those two are going to duel. I believe that's next week's or next week's ep the week after next. I believe it's next week's episode. Also, um, for some odd reason, the dragons, the the all all the dragon cards are starting to glow like uh, Odd Eyes, Dark Rebellious, and uh, Clear Wing Synchro Dragon, and that makes me think: Is that the whole? We have to be aware that Yuri is on his way there. Is Yuri on his way there? I don't know, but with that being said, I honestly think between the duel between Gong and Zaka and Crow, I think Crow got this in the fucking bag because who wants to fucking see Gong and Zaka beat Crow and him go further into the tournament? I fucking don't. They make Gong and Zaka look like a likable character, but I do not want to see him instead of Crow further in the tournament. And I just can't wait for this shit to actually pretty much finished so we could get the rematch between uh, uh, Yuya and Jack Atlas because the way that they made Yuya lose they better make Yuya come back and whoop Jack Atlas' ass because Jack Atlas he looked at too goddamn strong in this episode but with that being said you guys this is Herman Frost and you're watching Taco Weekly don't forget to like comment and subscribe over and out peace